Ahoy there, I'm Tiny Pirate, and welcome back to another brick in the mall. Look at this place, it's just humming, especially if I accelerate it. So it's ticking along very nicely, and I, I just still can't believe this place. It's so nuts. Look at that giant supermarket. It's just bananas. Anyway, our food court over here has needed some names. So I have some names that have been suggested to me, so I thought I'd work through them. Oh, just calm down you guys, I need to slow it down or they're going to give me a, a stress attack or something. So first of all, we've got some restaurant names, so I quite like Down the Hatch by Haston. So let's sort that out now. Down the Hatch, it's a good one. Uh, Dog Miner suggested a Keel Hauled. Now, that might have been for the whole centre, but I think instead for the whole centre, I'd like to call it Port Royal. Port Royal. I can't uh, actually figure out how to make that work, though. I can't name the whole area without uh, without it being a shop or something. So, uh, Napalm High School suggested Ye old Stock. Oh, yeah, it works. Ye old Stock. The restroom, I'm just going to call it the Heads. The Heads. The Heads. Uh, fast food restaurant. This one. Uh, what else have I got in here? There's some, some other good names in here, I'm sure. Blackbeard's food was suggested by Spider Alex, but I actually like Blackbeard's ration better. Sounds more sailorly. Beard's ration. That's looking very nice. And one more. I thought there was one more. One more, one more, one more. Skimming my comments right here. Uh, Skills Pronto suggested stern fries. I'm not quite sure what stern fries would be, so I don't know, we'll go with it. Why not? Stern fries. Is it just a fries place? Uh, they are very stern when they sell them. I, I don't know. It's not at the back of the boat. Uh, there was another good idea I really liked uh, for a little shop from Peter Jones, and he suggested a kind of touristy shop called Luton Things, and that it would sell jewelry, necklaces, touristy items, toys, bottled water cameras, little film ones. And it would sell things like, I guess, T-shirts, I think, would be good. So I'm going to do that. I reckon that'll be cool. So this one needs to be loot and things. Loot and things. And it needs to... Um, oh, actually, one more thing. I just need to come over here because I want to get a, a bit of row done. And I'll explain why later. Okay, cool. We'll do that. So, uh, loot and things needs to have a storage attached. There it is. It needs to have a couple of cashiers. Um, you two will do, and a stock clerk you'll do. And uh, what else does it need? It probably needs some uh, objects in it, like checkout counter. We'll go for a couple of checkout counters. Go for a clothing rack. That's where people are going to be able to get their novelty shirts. Novelty cameras and things from the um, from the tables there. Uh, what do these things hold that's useful? I'll oh, probably books, tourist books, things like that. Um, we'll need some fridges for drinks and oh, and snacks. Our food shelf can take our snack requirements. It seems a bit tight there. I want to give them a bit of room. So yeah, something like that will work, and they should all. Come in during the day. What's wrong with it? Check out counters, product shelves. So we do need to actually fix that. So one of the things that uh, someone pointed out, I'm sorry, I can't remember who it was. Whoa, wrong maintenance center. Is that this maintenance center here with all these builders, there's like a ton of them assigned and they're just not needed because we don't build over there. So they all have to walk for miles. They come to work, they check in, walk halfway across the mall and then probably leave for the day by the time they get there. So we're going to fire all of them. It's just commerce, all right? You can't feel sorry for them. It's just market economics. No safety net here. You are gone, son. Or sunnies. I think that's what you call ladies, right? So sons and sunnesses are all fired. The good news is I'm going to hire some of them down here at uh, maintenance center third. <laughs> no. Where are you? Where? Where? Galley stores. Nope. Nope. Ye old stock. Oh, silly. So, look, they actually come pre-skilled because I hired and fired them and they, they kept some of their skills. That's quite cool, I thought. Going to be very helpful. Um, I have a few of them work nighttime, a few of them work daytime. 
I think there's a bit of rubbish building up, so I'm going to hire a couple of janitors as well. Make them work a little bit later on. Not a builder, janitor. There we go. And they can work later in the day. Keep our, keep our place tidy. Clean up after everyone. So let's have a look. Did we have a... Oh, we haven't got any products on these shelves yet. So this one is going to be the first aid and drugs. Because people, you know, they need like their various uh, headache pills and all that junk when you're out and about. Uh, we're going to have soda in these ones, uh, bottled water and juice in the others. Come on, I need more building done. Oh, now, I wish you what I could do is it sort of would seem to make sense to have some uh, walls on this one, I think. I mean, yeah, there's a shop. Uh, I don't know if I want to go too over bit overboard with walls. Maybe we'll just do a, a little bit of walls like that. That looks nice, doesn't it? Uh, up here, it's all going to be good. I want to remove some other walls. Keep it nice and open for people. And over here, what I thought I would do is I would like to put in a park. And the park is, I'm going to slow it down once it gets to daytime so they can get building. And I'll slow it down right now. The park is going to be a place for people to come and fly quadcopters because that's how I roll. I'm not going to be able to put many stunt things in for it, though. So we're going to have a little, I don't know, 7x7. Seven seven. One, two. Eh, eh. I'm not going to go overboard on symmetry. So you don't all have to sit here and watch me do it. I am a little... <sighs> I do get a... <sighs> you silly fools. I do get a little bit uh, obsessed with things being nice and orderly. I don't know if anyone else is the same. One, two, blah, blah, something like that. But I need to really get over it, otherwise nothing will ever get built. Spend all my time staring at uh, symmetry-type screens and won't be able to achieve much. How much was that even? I could at least get that part right. Uh, no, I think we can get a little bit better. Five by 30 like that. Five by... Uh, come here. Uh, something like that will do. Crack on with it. We can put some adorable decorations in and it will look like quite a nice sort of park for people to come and visit. Hope so anyway. Now, all of this is working except there's no stock yet. Oh, here we go. So clothing rack, that's where we get our adorable, you know, comedy uh, T-shirts that you get. You need hats, but never mind. We'll get the comedy T-shirts. Here we go, electronics. We're going to have cameras for the for people visiting. And what else do they need? Jewelry, of course. Here we're going to have our snacks. Candies. Oh, what else do we need here? Household items, health and beauty. We did the first aid. So this is where we can get toys, you know, like the wonderful snow globes, tourist books. And music of terrible local bands that they're trying to flog as a kind of authentic local thing comedy men's underwear always appreciated uh what else do we have juice no booze of course so it's just going to be more bottled water which they'll sell for an exorbitant price if i can possibly help it and uh here food i kind of think we could have some more snacks and more candy. Oh, look at it. People love it. They like this place a lot. Wow. Kind of busy here now. It's attracted a fair few customers. Oh, five o'clock. Everyone's gone. Over here. What's wrong with that? Auto margin. I want to set the manual margin 200% on those expensive shirts. Oh, uh, I just... Mm, I built walls, didn't I, instead of foundations? <sighs> okay, never mind. We can just do this the slow way. We'll do it like this and tear down some walls while we're at it. Uh, there we go. Do this. And uh, remove walls. No, remove walls. Uh, we'll do it like I'm going to remove one wall everywhere just so they can get in and do the foundations. And then I'll take down the remaining walls. That sounds like a good idea. Um, 
Yeah, crack on with it, people. Get building. We might have to wait. Yeah, I suspect we're going to have to wait overnight. That's fine. Is they are these... Where are these stock guys going? Are there... Oh, they're having to park down here. There's not enough... That's interesting. It doesn't look like there's enough uh, parking for loading trucks. Going to have to sort that out too. Road work. So I need a road here. And it's just going to be for uh, loading stuff. We'll put loading all around. Anywhere else that we could be short on loading. I wouldn't be surprised if down here is as well. So I'm going to put a road in there for that. Over here. It seems, I think I could probably just remove road work and put in more, oh, well, loading's already there, there's four of them. They'll get onto that short, shortly, I'm sure. Meanwhile, we're still hemorrhaging money like crazy. <laughs> I don't mind. This is all built with loans and we don't have to repay them, of course. Right, well, the builders are going for it. Probably a good time to put in our adorable things. So we have our, in fact, maybe I'll put a, make it a bit more. Uh, make it a little bit more park-like by putting like a... See, I can't, can't really do a thin... Yeah, I can't really do, unfortunately. Let me have a look here. Uh, remove walls, remove walls, remove walls. Can't really do like a thin pathway, which is a bit of a shame. But I could put in... I can definitely put in the... I'm looking for them. See, I can put in the, the, the pot, potted plants along here to make like a pretty hedgerow for, for visitors. Um, yeah, we'll do it like that. There we go. No one is going to visit. And as I set up maybe a tiny kiosk, which I might just do. Set up a tiny kiosk and get them visiting. Now I think we're going to have to take some out in the middle or people aren't going to be able to, you know, get in and out of our beautiful arranged park thing, are they? They're going to be stuck in this lane. So do something like that. There we go. It's looking pretty good. Uh, da, 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 da. Don't you dare. I know there's some of you out there right now counting my gaps, figuring out where I've gone wrong. And you'll no doubt happily tell me, and I don't mind that. But I'm not going to do anything about it because I'm trying to get over being totally and utterly uh ridiculously sort of paranoid about placement. Um, we discussed that earlier, people. Can't hold me to placing things properly. Come on. Okay, builders, get on with it. Why are you not? Oh, gosh, I need, I need more of you. There you are. Builder, look, I've got a stock of them here. I'm going to have all of them. I don't care how much money it costs. They're all starting at five. I want overnight, midnight for you. Uh... 11, 12, 10 for you, whatever, midnight for you. No, late. We want builders all hours of the night and day. Are you building for me now, people? Hmm, getting there. I think it would be nice to have a little park shop. So maybe we will make a little foundation. We'll stick it. I don't like those trees there. So I think over here is probably quite nice. We need a pond of some kind as well, don't we? And it's going to have to be slightly long. That will do. And of course it's going to need... Oh, it's going to need a little storeroom. Oh, that's going to be a... All right, we'll build a little storeroom for it. And we'll stick it out the back. Just that that should be big enough. And so that's going to need a staff door here. Oh, walls. Give me a wall. 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 Object staff door. And I wouldn't mind giving it some kind of courtyard, but it's not really uh, going to work that way, is it? Because uh, they will be they will be expected to close after dark, the same way the, the parks do. I draw a store. No. Storage. And a store. And we're going to call it... Uh, hmm. Hmm. Pieces of eight. I've realized I've probably missed the opportunity to make like a really adorable little, I don't know, park design in here that looks very piratical, but that's just going to have to be how it is. Uh, also, we don't quite have the drawing fidelity yet that would be nice to, to help that. 
Okay, that's looking good. Oh, I do just want to get in the mm, loading zones here since we seem to be so short of them. And uh, customer parking we can go like that, I think. That should be fine. Oh, down. There was one more spot. Here it was. Loading zones all the way down there. Yeah. Okay, so pieces of eight needs. It needs a single till. Where are you? A little till. I don't think it needs more than one cashier. And we're going to put the cashier right at the door. And then it needs some food shelves. And it needs some drinks shelves. And it needs some shelf shelves. Uh, yeah. Now we can manage our little adorable shop. Let's get it some staff. One cashier. Uh, you will do. One stock clerk. Uh, you will do. Nine to five job. And we'll let them build and get it nice and running. Check out shelves. Yeah. So that's going to be a nice little park. I think I could probably make this a little bit more decorated. I'm really trying here. There's not a great, not a great deal of options for the average uh, park builder just yet. I'm sure there will be. I know American can have nice parks, so I want to have some around my giant mall as well. It should make everyone feel a lot happier, willing to spend more money. It's got lots of trees, so for any quadcopter pilots out there, there's lots of good racing around those trees to be done. Other than that, I think, oh, it's not looking too bad. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if anyone's ever going to come and visit, but... Oh, look, I can give people a little water dispenser. Yeah, that's quite nice. They can come and have a drink of water at the fountain. Hmm, would seem to make sense to put one here, but it's going to mess things up, so I'll leave it. ATM. And where are we? A rubbish bin? Rubbish bin of some kind? Oh, we probably need a little block of toilets, don't we? We just need a bit, of, a bit of toilets in the park. Might attach them. Oh, they're going to look a bit weird attached to the side here. Because they, they need to be long due to the shape of toilets. We'll put them behind the, behind the shop. There we go. They don't need to be too big. So now, product. Uh, again, we're going to need uh, ooh, blah, 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 candies, um, snacks, and cookies, uh, drinks, we need soda, and of course we need ice creams, because we're having a nice time, and we need uh, juice. Oh, we, I feel like we need another fridge, but I can't really fit it in. That's okay. We're not going to worry about water. Clothing, media, toys, we need tourist guides, and we need uh, books. Brilliant. Get on with it, little pack. I, I want to kind of draw in there as well. Where are we? Floor tiles. Oh, uh, what would be adorable? Uh, developer, I really think we could do with a few more varieties here. Things look a little bleak right now. Um, do these need to be a different type of tile? Can I do it? Oh, I can't do it like that. Oh, that's kind of cute. Ish. Except for when I screw it up. Um, that's okay. We'll do it like that. And oh well, yeah, that that could that has that has possibilities, doesn't it? I mean, there's there's definitely options there for making this place look cool. I'm getting my art on. Oh, not like that. Or maybe I'll do it like that. There'll be like little inverted T's everywhere. Works for me. People visited that shop, so that's good news. Uh, now we need to do the up here the bathroom, and we need a, a door course and cubicles it's a unisex kind of place here they don't mind i don't mind if they don't mind bit less toilet urinals get your tackle out start weeing um toilet sink i'm going to put a wall in oh i need to put a wall in mm, i don't know if i can get around that just going to go with a toilet sink like that and a paper dispenser like that. And maybe another toilet sink. Yeah, and another urinal. Oh, I don't know. I'm just... Yeah, paper dispenser. That that will do. That's fine. Yep, that's fine. A sign. Where are we? A restroom. 
And I think that will do. Put the door in, fill it in. What does it need? Toilet sinks. Yes, done, done, done. And now we need to probably give it a name. Oh, I'm getting very short on names here. The long drop. We'll call it the long drop because, you know, it's in a place like this. Now, I do feel the urge to throw in a few more feel, sort of floor tiles here. Uh, I think the bathrooms look good with these white tiles. And over here, I don't know, do we do wood? Do we do different types of concrete? I don't know, that's, that's just that. Oh, that's a kind of fine concrete. All right, that, that could do. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna clear that maybe. Ah, it'll work, it works for me. This concrete here, uh, maybe I will go like this. Yeah, it looks kind of like a, a, a carefully designed pathways around a garden, right? I'm gonna say yes. You should also say yes. Um, and I can't paint anything unless it's in some kind of nice large field. But I think that works for now. Are there any other useful objects that I might want to lay out? Got little ATMs in here. I'd like to see the shop running again. So we'll wait for that. Just chuck a bowling lane in. Yeah, I'll chuck it in the bathroom. No, maybe not. Uh, spectator seats. Don't need any of that. We could do with some outdoor tables. It would be good to be able to select a zone outside and make like a little park zone. I think that works for now. Not exactly a big storage area there. Over here, plenty of parking. So I'm hoping we'll solve that problem with all the loading trucks everywhere. And a food court. Well, let's wait till let's wait till morning. Almost time. Here it comes. Hooray! The tills are gonna be running hot. People are already coming. Where's our staff? Ah, I don't know. They'll turn up eventually. Don't stress, tiny pirate. Oh, I should put like a little door here and seems weird. Oh no, that works. There? No, th there? Does that, does that work? Yeah, that works. Okay, that's great. Wow. What? <laughs> that is massive. What is everyone doing? Food courts are getting busy. We've got builders hanging around. That's okay. I <laughs> just, just look at this. It's like a rat. A rat race. I don't even know what to think of it anymore. Over here. Well, the park's quite nice. Oh my goodness. People really want to drink. Wow. I'm going to actually put a door here so they can get out. That was insane. How, how crazy busy was that? Well, you know what? I think now's probably a good time to end this episode. I can't think also of anything else to build in my beautiful mall. I've got a, a popular-ish cinema. It doesn't never gets that full, really. We've got a bowling alley over here. Always quite busy, but not actually, again, profitable. These little convenience shops here uh, and here are always just ram-packed and uh, make, us, make us money sometimes. Grog shop. Uh, what do we got? This diner. Brilliant. Electronics shop here does pretty well. Very profitable. All those big white goods. Over here, supermarket. And our little nascent food court down here. I don't really want to spec out all the different shops right now. It'd get a bit dry. So I think I'm just going to leave it like that. We get the idea. And our beautiful park. The most scenic and attractive park. Oh, and of course the mall. The mall is amazing. Sort of. The sideways skull pointing to a beautiful tiny pirate park. Yeah, it's lovely. I think you'll agree. Anyway, I think that's probably it for the series. If you have anything else you'd really like to see me build, do, me, do let me know. But otherwise, stick around for more management games, more builder games. I like to play them. More interesting little weird oddities that I uncover. And I uh, hope to uh, see you around. Thanks all very much for watching. I hope you all subscribe if you're not already. And uh, until next time, I've been Tiny Pirate. Good night. <laughs>